paper lovers, it's Sarah, and it's time for another Terrific Tuesday Challenge over on the Scrappy Moms blog. I'll put a link down at the bottom to their blog so you can play along. Every other Tuesday they have a Cricut Challenge, and they pick the, from both Tuesdays of the month, they pick a winner to win some of their fabulous stamps. So this week the challenge is the Preserves cartridge, and I don't have that one, so if you don't have it, just use something similar. So I went with the strawberry cards. I know there's lots of uh, fruits and veggies on that cartridge. So I um, chose to use a card base from the Wild Card cartridge. And this is uh, cut at 4.3 in my Gypsy. And I just added some white stitching around it. And that is my card base. And then my little circle here. I got mine from Winter Woodland, but there's circles on all kinds of cartridges. And it's cut at 4 inches. And this adorable pattern cardstock is from DCWV. It is the Farmer's Market stack. came out a while ago. It's really cute. And it's like vines. So I thought it would be cute for like the strawberry. I'm going to stick that in the center of all my stitching. Hopefully. Pretty close. Okay, and I have a little bow here that's just tied with some red ribbon. And I'm going to stick that down using a glue dot. Okay. And I'm just going to stick that right here at the top of my card. Okay. And then for my sentiment, I am using the Scrappy Mom set. This is one of their new ones, Good Eats. And I'm using the set that says, I mean the sentiment that says, I'm so very sorry. And I stamped that on a little tag that I got from Tags, Bags, Boxes, and More. And it is cut at 1.75. And then I just added some white stitching around it and a little bit of twine to the top. And I believe that is going to go right here. But I'm going to wait till I put my strawberry on. Now I have two different strawberries. <laughs> um, I got the strawberry from Simply Charmed and she's cut at 3.75 and I stamped the Peachy King stamp from Everyday Character Face Assortment and it's the little girl one that's like gasping. She's like, oh! And I cut, or I'm sorry, it's the stamp that's one inch. And I added some little freckles with a black pen and then I just colored in her eyes. So I have the one that looks like this. And then I thought it would be kind of funny if she had a bite taken out of her. <laughs> but I was so afraid to cut her, so I made another one. And I took a, I just, you know, cut a little half circle so it looks like somebody bit her. Because it kind of goes with the I'm so very sorry. So I wasn't sure if I wanted to use that one or the one that's not bit. And I think I like the one that's not bit better. But I was kind of curious what you guys thought. So go ahead and if you're going to comment leave which one you like better. So there's the knot bit and there's the one with the bite taken out. So tell me which one you like better and just curious. Okay so I'm going to grab some foam squares and I think I have one big foam square left so I'll put that in the center and then I'll just add a couple little ones around it. I get my foam squares from Michaels. They're by Recollections. Okay, so it's going to kind of stick her down here a little bit crooked. And then I'm going to just stick some blue dots on my sentiment. Or on my little tag here. Okay. That's going to go right like that. And then I have a little red button and I tied a little bow from some maraschino Baker's Twine that can also be purchased on the Scrappy Moms blog. And I just adhered my little bow with a mini glue dot. And I'm going to grab another mini glue dot. They're so hard to see how it is. You know what? I think I need another one. Okay. Okay. And 
And this is going to go, if I can get it off my finger, right there on my tag. And then I have another little tiny bow out of that twine that I'm going to put on my strawberries. I'm going to grab a glue dot. And that's it. It's my little I'm so very sorry card. Oh, she's cute. Can you see her face? She's gasping. Oh. Alright, so that's it. Um, hope you get a chance to play along in the challenge. Thanks everybody for stopping by. Have a blessed day.